Okay, the reason I'm recording this video is because I've had some questions on this yarn over SSK stitch. So I thought I could demonstrate it for you. Obviously I'm not making the hat, I'm just making a sample. So when you go to do this stitch, your first stitch is of course just your knit stitch before you move into it. Now um, I'm going to do the yarn over and then I will be performing that SSK on a stitch that was a knit stitch on the other side, so now it's a purl, and then that yarn over. Of course, you still do it just as you ordinarily would, slipping each of those knitwise and then inserting your, your left hand needle tip back up through those stitches and knitting it. Um, the biggest issue with this stitch is that the tighter you pull your yarn, the more difficult this stitch becomes to the point where it's just awful. So the biggest thing you can do to help yourself out is not pull your yarn too tight. Um, it helps, first of all, if you're knitting a fiber that has some stretch to it, that helps a lot. Um, but you can also try, when you get to the, the knitting part, you can try to use your thumb to hold your yarn down so that it doesn't pull too tightly. That, that can help, oops, that can help a little bit too. The other big thing you can do is if you're able to knit continental style instead, um, that helps you get some more control over your yarn tension and not pull it so tightly. And you can perform the same yarn over SSK continental style and not have it get so impossibly tight to work.